first you want to look at my video called skipping grand lift of Deptis. it will take you to this ruined strong precipice outlook grace now once you are here you want to go summon a great horn tragoth he is a npc helper then you want to traverse into the mist and this is the location of a dragon that holds an overpowered sword that we want to get from him. Now, I am using the Ansper Rapier. It has Guarded Rock uh, effects. Now, I suggest you look at my channel on how to get this Guarded Rock weapon. It is overpowered. And I also have a another Guarded Rock uh, pit uh, called the Rotten Stray. Well, they're actually spirit ashes that you can summon. But in any case, the NPC helper uh, has a big hammer that's keeping the dragon very busy. And all you need to do is sneak behind him and poke him with the uh, Scarlet Rot uh, Rapier. It's called the Antsper Rapier. I have it in my channel. Just search for it. Now you only need to poke them a few times with the R1 button. Uh, if you want to do long distance pokes, you can use R2 or L2. For example, this is L2. It does a great poke. Now notice that I am not doing many uh, attacks on them. I'm just waiting for opportunity to poke them with this Ansper Rapier. It's overpowered. You just need to hit a few times and he starts getting Scarlet Rot. Now what Scarlet Rot does is make his health uh, lower, but you need to exceed the Scarlet Rot uh, meter. Now I'm gonna use this Rotten Stray. It's a summon that also bites Scarlet Rot. And with both this rapier and his bite, you are gonna fill up his Scarlet Rot meter very quick. And so basically, the NPC I summon is keeping him busy while the dog and me are poking him with Scarlet Rot. Pretty soon, he is gonna get Scarlet Rot meter full. And when that happens, he will start losing all his health slowly and there's nothing he can do about it. Now, if you look at the, the health meter, notice that uh, it is at that point that each poke it lowers. Now I'm going to poke a, a lot of times and notice that it is slowly decreasing even though they are not hit him, hitting him. That means Scarlet Rock has started and the dragon will lose health and usually he will lose it to zero. If not, you can uh, start it again, the meter. But if you use your dog and with this weapon, it fills up real quick. And basically, I am just gonna walk around and wait for his health to go to zero. And once it does, we can get his great weapon. Now, his weapon is a scale sword. It does fire damage, and it has a great, uh, great overpowered attack that I'm going to show later in the video. Be sure to watch to the end of the video. I will show all the movesets of this weapon. Now the dragon is now down to zero, so we're going to get his weapon. Please give video a like. Now we get the Magma Wern Scale Sword. And we get a Dragon Heart also. And now there's a grace that you can activate after the dragon is dead. To get out, you just want to hop up here and there's an elevator. Uh, hit the center, but if the elevator is not down, you do need to pull the gear so it goes down to, to lift you up. And you just have to touch the center to go back up. 
So this is how you get back up and that continues the story. But in any case, I want to show the move set. Um, so we'll go look at the weapon. Notice the stats, it has fire 74. Now that uses mana. I'm going to show you the moveset. This is R1. This is R2. Now L1 is just a hand attack. L2 is a fire attack. This is awesome damage. It is overpowered. Now the fire only burns others. It will not burn you. And that's great. To switch into uh, two-handed mode, hold triangle and press R2. Now here's another move set R1, R2. R2 is very powerful down attack. L1 is block. This is great for blocking. And now L2 is another very powerful fire attack. Look at that. You just died in this one move. Now I will show you this new boss that they added in version 1.03. I'm gonna use the two handed L2. Look, I just need to do it twice and he will just die to slash a few times. Now this boss is usually very hard. There it is. Get it twice and slash, he's gone. It's very powerful. Very, very, very powerful dragon sword. Another unique feature is that you can just press R1 and it causes fire damage. And this uh, does not use up any mana, the blue stuff. And so basically this weapon is overpowered. You should get this. I have a video showing how to get to that location. You have to search for it also. Right now I'm gonna show attack with regular R1. Just fast swings. You can also jump attack. That's a very powerful move. I'm gonna kill all of them. This is the last guard here. Okay, please give video a like, please subscribe, and we'll see you next time.